Yo, what up guys, Ross Cops here, and in this video, I'm reviewing Bad Boys Ride or Die. Alright, so everyone knows Bad Boys. You know, what you gonna do about it? <laughs> Alright, so this is the fourth installment of the Bad Boys series. You know, you got Will Smith coming back, Martin Lawrence, along with some of their notable characters from the series. And so this movie is basically about... The cartel, they're trying to frame Captain Conrad for some illegal stuff. And Will Smith and Martin Lawrence obviously know that's not true. And so they try to stop it. But in turn, they become fugitives and are now on the run, trying to clear his name. Yep. You know, the Bad Boy series, uh, I'm not going to say it's great, but it's entertaining. And going into the movie, that's kind of what you have to expect. You're not expecting, you know, Planet of the Apes. You're expecting something better, you know? <laughs> no, but you're going into this realizing, you know, you're going to have some action, some comedy, uh, maybe some over-the-top stuff. But for the most part, you know what you're getting. And that's kind of what you have to go in expecting. Um, and I think if you go in expecting, you know, something similar to Bad Boys 1, 2, or 3, I'd say more 3, then you'll come out satisfied with this movie. And overall, I enjoyed it. And I think the best thing about this movie was Martin Lawrence and Will Smith. And I'll say Martin Lawrence in here. He was funny. You know, he had a lot of jokes in here. And um, just the way he delivered them was funny to me. I think he was the standout in this movie. And obviously, Will Smith, he did good. And they kind of grew both the characters in different ways. And I think just them two alone carry this movie. I'm not going to say that the other people don't, but they are the main standouts like they should be. And like the action. The action was really good. Uh, you know, it, some of it might have been over the top, but it was still enjoyable to watch. You know, especially the club scene and even the chopper scene, which I was a chopper as high as a plane in the sky. And falling forever, but you know, it's a movie, right? It's a movie. But you have that along with, you know, like I said, the comedy was funny. I mean, it might be hit or miss. You know, some of it was like miss for me. But for the most part, it was hitting and it was funny. And Martin Lawrence, like I said, he was really funny. And you know, it was cool when Mr. Fantastic showed up. You know, my whole theater was going crazy. Thought it was a return of Marvel. But then they realized he was just a politician. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, this movie is what you expect from a bad boy's movie and i think this is probably one of my favorite ones if not my favorite uh, i'm not saying the other ones were bad i'm not saying that i'm just saying for me personally this might have been my favorite as far as some of the cons i would say uh it might be slow at first you know slow start to get into it once it's going it's just flowing like water and another thing is like it might be predictable obviously like you know what's probably going to happen at towards the end of it and everything and like i said there's some over the top action scenes uh even some slow-mo scenes that are kind of like pointless in my opinion but trying to be funny so for me personally i'm gonna rank this a piston cup but with that being said i just want to say thank you guys for watching another movie review comment down below uh what your thoughts are if you saw this if it's your favorite one or where it ranks on your list and so uh with that being said i'll see you guys on the next one peace